This is a ridiculously important video, so please save it and come back to it later, because in the exams you get given a formula sheet for physics, so it has the equations on it. You do not need to learn the equations, but what you do need to learn are your units, because they are not on the formula sheet, and if you cannot access your units, it's going to be really, really hard for you to go to the formula sheet and be able to interpret what the formulas are doing, be able to interpret what the questions are doing. So in this video, I'm going to go through all of your units for you. So you can just watch this video over and over and over and over again to get your units um, or you can put them on flashcards or you can do whatever works best but please 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 take the time to learn your units. So joules is the unit for energy, this is kinetic energy, gravitational potential energy, um, energy of, the, of a spring, all energy is in joules. Mass is in kilograms, that is kg. Please it's really important if you see something in grams convert it into kilograms. Velocity or speed is in meters per second. Remember that velocity has a direction attached to it, whereas speed doesn't, so that is m slash s. Then we have gravitational field strength. This is either 9.8 or 10 newtons per kilogram. You will get given the value in the exam, but please learn the units. Distance, height, length, extension, that is all in metres, not in centimetres. Please remember to convert that into metres. The unit for power is watts, that is a capital W. Time is measured in seconds, so please convert everything into seconds. If we're looking for charge, the unit is coulombs, and this is a capital C. For current, it is amps, and that is a capital A. Potential difference is measured in volts, and that is a capital V. Resistance is measured in ohms, and that is a funny ohm like symbol when we have weight or force that is measured in newtons because your weight is the force that you exert upon the earth so weight force newtons and please that is a capital n work done is another one that is measured in joules so you can see energy work done both measured in joules. So if you want to jump between an equation that has work done and an equation that has energy in it, joules is the way to go. The same with force and um, weight, both are newtons. So you should jump from one equation to another equation. The spring constant is measured in newtons per metre. Moments are measured in newton metres, so they are different things. Please be aware of that. Pressure is measured in pascals and volume is measured in metres cubed. Area is measured in metres squared. Momentum is kilogram metres per second. Specific heat capacity is joules per kilogram degree C. Acceleration is metres per second squared. And density is kilograms per metres cubed. Please learn these. It's going to make your life easier.